since I've had over 40 surgeries on all parts of my body, thoracotomy, two brain surgeries. At just 14, Jacqueline Child was diagnosed with dysautonomia, a neurological disorder. She had to overcome uh, a lot of health problems. Overnight. But one problem that surprised her? Dating with a disability is hard. People would tell me I was a burden or their family suggested that not to date me because it was going to be a life filled with stress. I never had to worry about people making insensitive comments about my health, my body, my future. And I just watched that kind of deflate her. That's when Jacqueline and her sister Alexa, a public interest attorney, decided to do something about it. They created Dateability, a dating app for the disabled. So we want disabled people to date, and that includes all disabilities. Physicist Lowell Morgan has a damaged spinal cord and has trouble walking. He's tried traditional dating apps. Now he's trying Dateability. I've gotten lots of hits. I think I've chatted with three women. Matthew Shapiro, born with cerebral palsy, specifically likes Dateability's unique profile descriptors called DEETS, which allows users to include details of their disabilities. Which sort of eliminates that whole awkward conversation, uh, which, which is is refreshing and definitely makes it easy. In less than a year, 10,000 people have signed up to swipe right, with 1,000 new users joining the group each month. And it's totally free. Our goal isn't to make billions of dollars, but our goal is to change the social experiences of the world's largest minority. I'm Alexa Lorenzo reporting.